Hello, I'm MSBA President Keith Trufer. Welcome to the MSBA President's Message for November 2018. Today, I'd like to tell you about a number of exciting things happening in the MSBA. First, I'll speak about our recently concluded Conference of Bar Presidents, which took place this past weekend. Second, I will describe another great event happening next week for all small firm and solo practitioners, and that's the MSBA Solo Summit. Third, I want to tell you about the great work being done by MSBA members who volunteer their time to promote citizenship and the rule of law among Maryland's high school students. Finally, as I do each month, I will give you an update on the progress being made in the MSBA Lawyer Assistance Program. First, the Conference of Bar Presidents. On October 26th and 27th, this past weekend, the MSBA convened its annual Conference of Bar Presidents at the National Harbor Conference Center. The conference brings together bar leaders from around the state, including local and specialty bar presidents, presidents-elect, and executive directors, fellows of the MSBA Leadership Academy, young lawyer representatives, and representatives of those organizations which provide pro bono legal services. This annual event is one of the very best things we do for our members and for Maryland lawyers. The conference promotes important communication between the leaders of our profession in a way which might not otherwise occur. During the conference, attendees received presentations on cybersecurity, a threat to all members of our profession. They attended lessons on civility and lawyer wellness and received an update on recently enacted legislation of importance to the profession. Bar leaders had the opportunity to attend breakout sessions grouped by large, mid-size, and specialty associations to discuss issues unique to their members. Many thanks to Ranju Shrestha and Karen Butcher, co-chairs of the local and specialty bar committee, other members of that committee, to our director of meetings, Wanda Calvin Claiborne, and to MSB's staff for an exceptional conference, a conference of bar presidents, bar leaders, energized and connected to improve our profession. Second, the MSBA Solo Summit. The 2018 Solo Summit will be held from 8.30 to 4.30 on November the 9th, 2018 at the Maryland Live Conference Center in Hanover, Maryland. It is organized to provide a special benefit for our small firm and solo practitioners. A wide variety of practical programs will be presented to assist MSBA members in learning how to start your practice, run your practice, and grow your practice. This program is critical to any lawyer who practices as a solo or who is within a small firm. You will receive education on how to maintain your trust in operating accounts, how to make sure that you'll get paid for your work, the newest technology available for your practice, how to handle e-discovery, and many other useful topics. Although the Solo Summit is just around the corner, there is still time to sign up go to the MSBA website and register today. By the way, the MSBA recently launched a new practice management portal that provides MSBA members with resources and tools to help set up, run, and manage a law practice. The resources and tools include white papers, checklists, articles, and on-demand webinars. New content will be added to the portal on a monthly basis. Take a moment to check out the Practice Management Portal, which can be found on the MSBA website under the For Members tab. Third, MSBA members promoting the rule of law. I'd like to tell you what MSBA members are doing in our community to educate our fellow citizens on civic responsibility and the importance of the rule of law. MSBA lawyers volunteer their time as part of the Maryland Youth and the Law Program, or as it is now called, My Law. My law has been teaching youth about the law and the American judicial system since 1975. My law presents such diverse programs as mock trials, law links, teen court, the Baltimore City Council page program, moot court, and the My Law Academy. These programs foster an understanding of and an appreciation for the law, the legal system, and the legal profession. On November 10th, the My Law Moot Court Competition will be held at the University of Maryland King Carey School of Law. I am pleased to be able to participate as one of the judges of the competition. More judges are needed, and if you would like to participate, go to www.mylaw and sign up today. 
Finally, as I've mentioned in the past, the MSB has partnered with CoreCare to provide a network of counselors available to MSBA members who may be suffering from mental health challenges, including alcohol or substance issues. That help is available at no cost and is completely confidential. If you know someone in need of help, please give them this number. To summarize, I've brought you up to date on our Conference of Bar Presidents, which took place this past weekend. The MSBA Solo Summit on November the 9th for all small firm and solo practitioners. The great work being done by MSBA members volunteering their time to promote the rule of law among Maryland's high school students. And finally, the Maryland State Bar Association Lawyer Assistance Program and its new contact number. Thank you for listening. Check back again next month to find out what's happening with your Maryland State Bar Association. And if you want to stay up to date with the MSBA, follow us on social media on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and LinkedIn.